Hello everyone, my name is Jason Parker. Welcome back to this channel about magic. As you may know, I've been making reaction videos for AGT and Penn and Teller's Fool Us, and I decided why not do something totally different? Why not react to a musician like this guy? Chris Clafford. I was watching last week's episode of America's Got Talent and I saw him perform and he's so good. He actually made me cry. I went through like five Kleenexes. So anyway, I thought it would be fun to make a reaction video and watch him here with you. And our goal, both you and me, will be not to cry. You're gonna have to be honest with me. You're gonna have to leave me a comment below and let me know if you were able to not cry. Just take those emotions and bottle them safely up inside where they belong. But just in case, I am prepared. And just to address something really quickly, you're probably wondering, why is a magician reacting to a musician? And that's actually a really good question. Anyway, let's go ahead and get on with the reaction. Maybe it's not a reaction, maybe it's just a viewing. Let's get on with the viewing. Talented people in here. Yeah. I feel like a little, like, like a little ant. I don't know. A little ant? Because there's so many ant. different people, huh? Yeah, yeah. My name is Chris Clifford, and I'm 20, no, no, wait, wait, I, I was, I'm 30. You're not used to that yet. I'm not used to it. Yeah. I hate to say 30, though. <laughs> what are you here for? Yeah, I'm, sure I'm gonna sing. I always loved music and performing for my family, but my parents wanted me to have like this everyday job so I could work like my brothers did. They didn't really listen to me. But I, I never wanted to join like a family business, so I, I just walked my own way, my own road. But it wasn't that easy because I didn't got any gigs. So I had to work like the liquor store for years, but I felt like I had to pursue this dream. I've been playing small bars and stuff for 10 years. My dad was like, keep on pushing, kid. And coming on this show, it means a lot to make my dad proud. I'm rooting for you, man. Go out there and give it your best, okay? This is like the first big step to my dream. It's like, <clears throat> I'm not gonna cry. It's like that. What's your name, please? My name is Chris Clifford, and I come from Sweden. Oh, cool. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> Hi, everybody. And I am gonna guess you're a singer? Yes, I am. Okay. Correctly. I grew up in a, in a, in a small village in Sweden. Yeah. With like top 15 people in it. And almost every one of them were my family. <laughs> <laughs> it's nice. I started to sing when I was in fifth grade or yeah. something. Yeah. And, and who, who was your inspiration as, as an artist? Uh, you know, I, I began with a lot of rock music when yeah. I was younger. So I listened to a lot of Kiss. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> all right, well, good luck. We're all rooting for you. Thanks so much. All right. You 
I did it, I didn't cry at all, and uh, I'll give you my thoughts now before we hear what the judges have to say. Yeah, he's just amazing, isn't he? I mean, that's just such a such an excellent voice. I just love the, the quality, the sound of it, and the fact that he came up there with just his acoustic guitar, and it's just his guitar and his voice, you know, he's not hiding behind just a bunch of noise. Not to mention, this is one of my favorite songs, and I think a lot of people love this song, obviously. But yeah, his voice just seems so pure and nice. I don't know, somehow it just gets me feeling emotional. How about you? Comment below if you cried even a little bit. I wanna know. And let's hear what the judges have to say. Chris, I saw how emotional you were and how much this means to you. How are you feeling now? Man, I... This is weird. <laughs> <laughs> this is... this is crazy. I mean, this is... This means everything. You know how they say, sing from the heart? You, you wore your heart on your sleeve. We could all feel it, and I think it was amazing. I'm just... I'm just blown away by your talent. I love the hair. Your beard is, <laughs> is flourishing. <laughs> Thank you. And don't you lose those skinny jeans. I'm here for all of it. Cool. Good job. I felt your heart, and I felt your passion, and that's what art is. What I loved about you was what you did with the song, with your vocal. I love people who can reinterpret a song, and you did something special with it just then. It was incredible. Thank you so much. Howie, yes or no? I gotta give you a yes. Gabrielle. It's a yes for me. Yeah. Thank you. 1,000% a yes. Oh, thank you so much. That's a lot of percentages. You know what's coming. Four yeses. Thank you so much. I gotta give you a hug, man. Oh, I gotta give you a hug. I think his voice is fantastic. I do too. It was amazing. I really like it. All right, all right. This is my man. So good to see you. Love you, man. Thank you. It's amazing. Oh, my God. Okay, now I'll give you my concluding thoughts about his performance. Anyway, I think I got most of my emotions out during the first viewing because I only needed like half of a Kleenex this time. I mean, I don't have emotions because I'm a strong man. Just kidding. It's okay to have emotions even if you're man, as long as you hide them away and bottle them up deep inside. At least I think that's what they recommend. Anyway, what a beautiful voice. Am I right? What do you think about that? Comment below. And I love the fact that he picked that Beatles John Lennon song. I think he's definitely gonna go really far in this competition. I would be surprised if we don't see him in this top five or 10, one of these last contestants in the show. To me, I feel like you can really see his talent when it's just his voice and his guitar. It's not a bunch of people. It's not a bunch of noise. It's just the raw talent. Anyway, that's just my opinion as a magician. I realize this video would probably make more sense if I was a musician reacting to a musician, but yeah. I just wanted to try this experiment reacting to something totally not magic related. I thought it would be fun. So please feel free to leave a comment below and let me know what you thought about this video. If you liked it, make sure to smash like. If you didn't like it, just quietly walk away. If you wanna see my reactions to other magicians, make sure to check out my homepage and maybe subscribe. I've also got some tutorials and street magic videos there as well. And that being said, I will most certainly see you next time. Yep.